Watch you guys, in this video we're going to be taking a look at how we can remove sharing of folders or drives in Windows 10. Now if you've created a shared uh, folder or drive in Windows 10 to share across your network, then you may want to remove those shares and this question come up in Discord uh, yesterday. So I thought I'd make a video to show you. So if you go up to the top here where your explorer is, you can type in here backslash backslash localhost and this will give you the shares that you are doing on your computer right now. You can see them here. We have two of them here. And these are just, um, you can see the little pipe work underneath the green pipe work. That means they are networked on your computer. If we right click on this and go properties here, it does give you a sharing option, uh, which you can then go into and go to advanced sharing. Now inside here as well, you can see there is a share uh, this folder you can remove this by just removing the tick and uh, then click apply and okay you can also remove the permissions for that as well but once you've removed uh, that off the uh, network there it should then disappear so let's take a look at this one here if we go down you can see give access to and you should see remove access here as well which is not on this feature here but you will see that feature where you can remove the access for it but or you can just remove the tick for that folder and just say yes, click OK and then click close and that will then remove once you refresh uh, there and it should remove that folder. And this will be the same process if you wanted to do this on a hard drive, you would do the same process, uh, remove um, permissions and stuff like that. Now go up to the top of my PC, type backslash backslash uh, localhost and you should now see there is no shares on this computer. So if you want to go back into Explorer here, let's go back into another drive here. And what we're going to do here is just quickly create um, a share inside here. Now inside here, if you right click on it, you should see give access to and you'll see remove access here and also specific people. So if you want to remove access, you can click on that remove access or if you want to give uh, permissions to a, a particular type of person you can go to specific people and add in here um, a person that you want to do you can put everyone on your network if you want to just put that inside that box there and you can click add now once you click on add this will add this uh, to your shares and you can see here read write or um, whatever you want to set that to so let me just quick quickly click on share here and you can see now that this folder is shared on our network so let me just show you here by clicking done and if you wanted to uh, remove that you can easily do that by the method I showed you previously but basically that's what I just wanted to show you there so let's take a look at our local host here now so we can go back to this PC do a double backslash and local host and you should now see that folder that we're sharing uh, on our network here just like so and you can see the pipe uh, underneath it and you should see uh, give access to and you can see advanced sharing and you can uh, click on that if you see remove access just click remove access and it will remove it uh, but if you do want to just go to advanced sharing here you can just do the same thing and remove that tick and it should remove those uh, from uh, your network and you should not be uh, sharing that content anymore it's that simple so yeah I, I think there was a bit of a a confusion there of the way to um, unshare folders or drives and that's basically how you can do it inside Windows 10 it's very simple and easy to do and I hope this one helps people out my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk now if you want to join our discord server I will leave the link in the video description and also in the comment section up the top there anyway thanks again for watching I hope to see you on discord bye for now now if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.